welcome back to Big Brown Listers to Reacts. I'm Taya Samach. What's up, y'all? And today we're going to be reacting to Bad Facts Season 3, Episode... Or Season 1, Episode 3. Yeah. They don't have a title yet, so I don't know what this is called. But, um, yeah, last we left off, um, they found Cut. Um, they were trying to go for him for advice on try how to hide. Um, but he's still trying to figure things out, too. He has to go rehive. Um, and he left with his family. They tried to get Omega to go, but she didn't want to. She wanted to stay with the Bad Batch, and I think she's earned her place. So we're going to see what journeys they have had for them this week. Um, and full and other reactions are on Patreon, as always. Oh, it's called Replacement. Well, that doesn't look comfortable for either of you. Rations are low. Hey, Omega doesn't even have a place to sleep. You want to take her food too? Oh, no, no thanks. You can. <laughs> okay. Echo, lights cut out again. Thought you fixed it. Yeah, add it to the list. <laughs> the things you thought you fixed, but didn't. Several systems have been glitching ever since. The shipwide diagnostic report indicated no critical systems were compromised. Sure about that? I'd say that's pretty critical, Tech. It's not detecting life support. We're fine. Are you kidding me? Hold on! I got to be so scary. I think it'd be kind of fun. I mean, yeah, I'd be scared to hit the ground, I guess. But the journey down is kind of fun. It probably isn't if you're in the front seat. We're gonna die. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Crash landings, I give it about it. Let's crosshair swept him, kid. Uh, I'm kind of eager to see crosshair again. I'll say it. I kind of miss him. Crosshair's actions were influenced by his inhibitor chip. It can do that? That's what it was designed Did to do. Did you not see what all the other so clones are doing? It wasn't crosshair's fault. No. Well, I guess asking you shall receive. You will be pleased to know. This is the same joy that helped five um, before it, it got us them right re what uh re but to comply. It helped five request. discover order sixty six, you know, back when he warned um, people but the then they killed him. Let's see if he stays that way. Because Palpatine didn't want to play and get him out. May I present our first elite squad of stormtroopers who can aim. Top soldiers from across the galaxy. A partnership such as this could have promise. I believe it will strengthen the future of this burgeoning empire. Not for the puppy. That stinks. So did your breath. I just brushed my teeth and I have gum in my stupid. Yeah, then that's bad. What? You brush your teeth and have gum in your breath still stink. I call you acid breath. My breath don't stink. Could have fooled me. Uh, what else went there? We landed. <laughs> you think? This is a really dark episode. Yeah. I don't know. Like, I swear I can't see nothing. Maybe it's a dragon. Do they like have dragons and stuff? Now it's just gone. And that was our last one. They have dragons and stuff. Of course they have dragons. They have dragons. dragons. A species that feeds on raw energy. It was probably drawn to the capacitor's electric charge. I'll go after the dragon and get that part back. Dragon's right. It's a dragon. Fine. You're staying. I'll go with you. No, that thing could be dangerous. I'm part of the squad now too. Right? She is. Alright, 
kid. I just love how they give her respect so when she asks for it. Um, eventually they'll learn to do it naturally, but I'm like that they don't treat her. They're trying to protect her, like they're doing their first duty as a uh, father brother, and that is to be parents Guardian. and say no. And then as a brother, all right, you can come without the protection. Join your military to be father stupid brother. and poked at. Send the clone and your recruits to Omero. I want Saul Ganeda's camp found oh. and wiped out. Let's see if they can succeed with Clone Force 99 failing. It shall be done. Oh boy. I can't see anything. What are you doing? Tracking. Just received the transmission from Guerrero. He's standing by at the rendezvous. All right, let's move uh, on. Guerrero's not even there. And they're all gonna die and never show up to the rendezvous. Since you've been triggered in Sector 2A. Uh, y'all might as well start gotten on y'all ship and run. Get our people on the show! Yeah. That's when you run for the show. Watch this. I thought it was a lightsaber for a second. Yeah, me too. It's getting away. He's hurt. I can't see. It's mad. Has it wake up? I legit just can't see nothing. Every now and then when there's a flash of light I can see. Can't see what you're doing, but go ahead, girl. Do your thing. I'm rooting for you. <laughs> it's <laughs> dark. <laughs> I'm gonna just close my eyes and use the force and try to sense what's going on because I can't see shit. Not the flamethrower. You gonna burn him to death? Like it's already bad enough you killing him. Oh. Missiles. That ship's taking off. Oh, they're gonna use. Oh, they shot the pilot. Oh, they're done. They should have been left. They should. Yeah, they should have. That's their fault. Uh, don't burn them. Please just shoot them. Please just shoot them. Clones lost their humanity. Good soldiers follow orders. So this must be why they decommissioned them because they can't tell the difference between Well, they have their mission, but like when there's normally a line you don't cross, they don't care about cross it. They're just like very aggressive and don't care and they just kill to kill. And I don't think the Empire is going to want, you know, they don't want civilians dead. Of course, they want to rule, but you can't rule if you're killing everybody, you know what I mean? Yeah. There's not going to be no people to rule, so this must be why they decommissioned the clones, because it's, that ship just made them... Humanity. They, it just, they lost all <laughs> morals, like, they have no morals, they're just, they're like robots, basically, you know? So I guess I can understand why they would want to switch to Stormtroopers now. Probably just an unforeseen consequence. It just doesn't like the light. Oh great, now we really can't see.
Impressive. The clone commander's new squad has followed through where his brethren did not. If Rampart has his way, conscripted soldiers will make clones obsolete. I fear for the future of our operation. It is time to begin the next phase. If your experiment can yield a superior clone, it will secure our relationship with this empire. The clones required will not return willingly. They are Kaminoan property, and we only need one. You already got one. Our survival hinges on it. They redesigned the room. But the mercs are still there. Seems like this still seems to see his normal mind. Come with me. Cover your eyes. No, <laughs> oh, Uncle Wrecker. He got something for her. He got her a room. Your own room. Ah, that was nice. I thought this place could feel more like a home. It's perfect. Thank you, Rico. Well, this has a nice view. <laughs> I never had my own room before, and he gave her a stuff well, stuff down You're part of the squad now, too. Oh. Wow. That was a good episode. Couldn't see much. Yeah, what, what we could see was good. The rest of it, it sounded good. <laughs> but, um, yeah, um... This one just kind of furthered the clone initiative thing. I, I really, what was going on with the Bad Batch, the, the main squad was just kind of like filler, really. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, at least I don't really know what happens so, <laughs> with on their parts. But the parts that I could see mostly was the crosshair in the new stormtroopers that they're creating. So the Kaminoans, uh, scientist people, they're trying to prove their usefulness. So they're trying to make more clones that are superior. Omega was probably one of the ones that's successful. But now that she's gone, they're gonna need to recreate her or like something like her. So it's gonna be interesting. They're probably gonna try to nab Crosshair so they can use his DNA or whatever they want from him. Cause they're trying to make more defective clones. So um, it seems like every thing Omega runs into it's a creature, so maybe she has like a special connection with them. Well, this creature didn't try to kill her, the other one did in the last episode. Sure. I don't know. So, her but her gift is, is still really unknown. Like I said, it has something to do with being able to predict or see things that are gonna happen. I don't know if it's like a force ability, I don't know. If it's just like a premonition thing she can do, I don't know. But I'm actually interested to see more. She's a really great character. I think a really neat addition to this show. Um, so yeah, um, but I, I mean, I don't really have too much else to say. I'm, I'm curious to see how Saw Gerrera is gonna react to what happened to his squad because he's waiting for them at the rendezvous. And I didn't think they would ever, I think they, I thought they would just kind of like show him as a cameo just for like story purposes, like a cool like cameo, you know, get people interested. But they're actually like putting him in a story. So I'm curious to where, like how he's going to react because we already know how he is in the future. So, and then I want to see what, what changes when he re-encounters the Bad Batch, like how he talks to them and treats them and how he kind of tells them what happens and like I don't know I just want to see how they're going to run into each other and what the conversation is going to be mm -hmm. if that makes sense um but yeah other than that great episode um be sure to let us know what you guys thought be sure to like comment share subscribe subscribe to Patreon for a full reaction and we will see you guys on the next one bye